I want to tell you how this amazing skill came into existence. In the early 1940s, I was one of a dozen or so graduate students in the psychology department of, o of Ohio State University who were inspired by Dr. Carl Rogers, a new professor. In various ways, we all were trying to find out what it was that the counselors did who were most effective in helping clients solve their personal problems. The answer finally became clear. They listened much more than they talked. Until then, helping people with personal problems consisted mostly of asking probing questions, giving information, advising, judging, analyzing, reassuring. Do you recognize those as some of our 12 roadblocks? Those traditional counselors didn't do much listening. 